hello everyone so in this video we are going to see how we can uh, password protect a directory using ht password file so to achieve that what i have done i have created a directory in my uh, local system okay so if i go to my ht docs and uh, you can see there is a directory known as ht pass and i'm using xamp here in my mac for for kind of mimicking the apache server okay so you can see this is the folder and i can access the file system here like uh, test.php okay so and you can find this test.php is inside this i can also access this url using uh, just test okay so this is how like uh, you can you can manipulate urls using uh, ht access but again this is not the video about ht access i'm just showing you because when I was doing this, I have written a line of code. Okay, so now how you can pro a password protect a directory and what is the use of it? So considering suppose you are uh, developing any application on a server and uh, you don't want anyone to see until it is developed, but you just want to test it on a live environment. Okay, so what you can do, you can use this, utilize this, okay, ht password thing and uh, you can password protect your directory at the time. Okay. So to do that, like you can see, I have uh, my ht access here and uh, ht password here. And you can find here, I have given the kind of uh, a complete path for this. So you can see like in my directories, jam, ht docs and uh, ht password. And uh, you can see here, I have written application because the application is the main folder, then jam and uh, so on. So you have to pass the kind of complete path, a relative path for that particular file and uh, in ht password you can see i have uh, this one my name is written so my name is username and password is my actually last name here so how you can generate this id password combination to do that you can actually just google like ht password generator which is like what i have did just before that so you can just search like uh, ht password generator okay and you can go to any link of your choice okay so for example i come here and i uh, type the username as my name and the password is like my uh, surname and uh, i get this combination so i copy it and actually i can paste it here so i've already done that so what i have done here you can see these are kind of right now right now commented so in ht access file you can comment things using this sign okay uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to remove these signs here, okay, I'm going to save this file and once I refresh it, okay, you can see it asks for the ID and password. So I'm going to put the ID and the password, okay, and uh, I can go inside, okay. So now let me just uh, kind of quit it again and I'm opening this one again, the browser, okay, and uh, I'm gonna again open the same file so it asks me for the password I just cancel it so you can see I cannot access it right now so if I refresh it and put my uh, ID and password again I can go inside I, and I can see the important file which is inside here okay so thank you all. thanks for watching let me know if you have any queries and in case if you like my video please subscribe to my channel thank you